Hello. In the following uh, video, we'll uh, show how to transfer files using the freeware Smart PTT file transfer. So we preparing. We are preparing a file as its name is uh, log, and it is looking like this. It is quite a big file in Word and this is because on the receiving computer I do not have Excel installed so I have to send it as a Word, Word file. First of all we are starting the Smart PTT file transfer server which is already connected we have here a list of uh, client station uh, ID which is uh, permitted to transfer files to this server and the server is uh, connected to uh, Motorola DP3401 station the, on the transmitter side the client software the client smart PTT file transfer it's connected to a uh, little station, a portable station, SL1600. So, we connect the server, the file client, to the radio. We select the file, which is log, docx, okay, and we start the transfer. We have also an analog FM receiver to monitor what is happening in the frequency. Well, we have to start the server. The client is polling the frequency and trying to reach the server. We expect the confirmation. And this is all. So let's check the file we received. Well, this is a valid document and the content that's exactly how we had it on the sender computer. A few comments about the programming of the radios. 
on the transmitter side, client side, we have to pay attention to some settings as TX preamble duration must be set to 60 milliseconds. We have to note this IP and uh, on the data channel we choose we have to be aware that data call confirmed it's not checked we also have to make some uh, uh, modification in the routing table to add some routes but these are explained very well in the help of the smart PTT file transfer. I recommend you reading this before trying anything else, especially this this part, route trace, route table settings. Okay. Thank you for your attention. Bye.